So uh, my dad's story is that he, he came on a raft. Uh, he spent seven days at sea, so I represented that with seven uh, stars throughout the whole project. Um, the whole message. Can you point out? Oh, I see. Yeah, seven stars. So here, 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 here. Bottom and top. Bottom and top. Um, so the whole message was going to be that I, I wanted to portray a Cuban that kind of like grabbed things that had these, these, these pieces of wood and, and these pieces around that had these political messages of oppression and, and these political messages that held them down, tied them to Cuba, and that's what they used for their freedom. Um, one of the main messages is Tatuate en la piel lo que prometas, which is tattoo on your skin what you promise. Uh, super political against Castro. Um, it's a multimedia piece, so it's very symbolic. I wanted to showcase everything um, in symbolism. So here at the multimedia, um, this spells out Fidel. It's F I D E and L. A bit abstract, but didn't want to make it too literal. Um, the chains uh, represent the oppression. Compañero revolucionario. Crossing out the, the revolutionario because they still need to be companions. They need to work together to try to, you know, change what's happening. Abuso, um, Patria Muerte is a very strong political um, campaigning there. Uh, Abajo con Castro, la historia me absolverá. I crossed out absolverá. Uh, la historia me absolverá is a, a story written by Fidel. Um, he always thought that. Um, he was going to be absorbed by history and that everyone was going to idolize what he's doing and I crossed it out and put Ol Olvidara because we need to forget and just kind of move on and make the best of the situation um, the stencil of Ed Che crossed out like if a little kid just came and just did that um, revolution with question marks because was it really a revolution was this better than what they had before uh, libertad justa what's Yuma 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 uh, okay, so Yuma, abandonar la isla por una eh, desconocida Yuma. Yuma, to a Cuban, is a word that means the best of the best, the highest. So they use it a lot to describe their freedom in the U.S. Um, they uh, abandoned not only their homes, but their family. They couldn't take jewelry. They couldn't take anything with them, um, especially if they came on a raft. Uh, my dad got here on a 4th of July, so when he arrived, it was fireworks. This was the dream for him. He was like, wow, this is amazing. Um, he got here with another four people. And Can you explain why there's an image of Che Guevara on this? Um, I wanted to put the image of Che Guevara because I, I, it, it is, that is what the government portrayed. And that is what the government stand, stood for, him and Carlos Marx. This is, uh, these are like political figures that promised so, so much and they stood for so much. And everyone idolized them. And at the end of the day, what they were doing was destroying you know, the culture. Um, the gum that is holding the project together everywhere is a story that my brothers told me when they got here. My brothers are 30 now, but they got here when they were 18. Um, my brothers, when they were little, in Cuba it's very hard to find candy, let alone food. But um, gum in particular was very hard to find. Whenever they would find it, they would chew it and they would preserve it in the freezer for months and re-chew it and re-chew it. And then when it lost the flavor, they would use it for um, glue, for art projects, for anything that they needed to do. Um, the sand, the seaweed, and the coconut are from the beach. Um, and the machete and the coconut is uh, kind of symbolic of the culture. Hey, let me see if I'm missing anything. Oh, the foam board to make everything. Oh, the newspapers. One of the newspaper articles is uh, the story that Miami Herald wrote on my dad when they first got here since it was the 4th of July, super um, symbolic. Um, the rest of the newspaper is a timeline from the day that Fidel first started the revolution to the day of his death. Yeah, it's pretty much the whole. What about this over here? That's a clock. Um, oh. I, I put a clock there because it's time for change. Um, here, there's also a line here that says, Hoy eres de ti mismo el mercenario. You are your own mercenary now. Symbolic of Fidel. And John? 